What's good guys, welcome back to Ron's Rise, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to another video where the Alfa Romeo Giulia GTAM is caught spotted testing in the rain. Yes, the $200,000 Alfa Romeo is, you know, getting a little wet here. Now, right now, this is Alfa Romeo's most anticipated car with no 6C, with no 8C. Alfa Romeo really just has a Giulia GTAM until the unveiling of the 2021 Tenale at the end of next year and then the BSUV following. But for hardcore Alfa enthusiasts, a SUV isn't really what you're looking forward to. But with that said, we have the Giulia GTAM, and this is the one that everybody's going to talk about when it comes to Alfa Romeo for the next year. So the hardcore Giulia GTAM is the one to spice up the lineup. Now, it was revealed back in March, and the two-seat sedan has been caught out testing on a rainy day. Now, with that said, the prototype is on the highway near FCA's proving ground in Italy, and this looks pretty sharp. Now, the Giulia's aggressive design is top-notch, really, with a giant ring and a massive diffuser, so you know it's the Giulia GTAM. Now, it's sporting different rims, and it is camouflaged for some reason. Now, it's not hiding much. I mean, you can see the large intakes, the fender flares, the Lexan windows, and the center exhaust. And with the extra bits, you're also shaving off a lot of weight with carbon fiber. 100 kilograms or 220 pounds is shaved off from the regular Giulia Quadrifoglio. So that sets it at 1,520 kilograms or 3,351 pounds. And you'll get a 0 to 62 in 3.6 seconds. It's really just a more hardcore performing version of the Giulia when you add the extra 30 horsepower on that 2.9 liter twin turbo V6. But you can also see things like the roll bar that's peeking through the window as well. And with this model, you also get two helmets and a fire extinguisher. Now, here's the issue is there's only going to be 500 made with none of them being sold in the U.S. and topping $200,000 for this limited GTAM. Now, keep in mind, the 9M model is being considered to be sold in the United States. But I wouldn't get your hopes up for the full GTAM as we know for sure that that is not coming to the States. So with only 500 made and being around $200,000, it's definitely a car enthusiast dream. But I'm wondering, what do you guys think about the camouflage? Why is it camouflage? And why are there different wheels other than the dark five hole wheels with those carbon ceramic brakes? I'm very curious, are they testing maybe a different model of the GTAM? Um, this is definitely baffling my mind a little bit, but for right now, this is what we think it is. And I mean, it couldn't really be anything else, could it? You guys let me know what your theories are down in the comments below. And with that said, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you did, you will get it up in the rankings. More people can see it. And we can have a bigger discussion on the camouflage version of what we believe is the Julia GTAM and not some other model that Alfa Romeo is testing. Now, with that said, if you guys want to further help support the channel, Check the links down below where I have a one-time link donation for my PayPal, Cash App, and Venmo in case you guys want to donate to my Maserati MC20 fund. And you guys can also check out my Patreon, be a monthly subscriber, or check out the Ron's Rise merch. Keep warm this winter. Get a hoodie, get a long sleeve shirt. You can even get a pillow or a coffee mug. Now with that said, check that out or follow me on social media. You got Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter. See everything I'm posting, Ferrari, Maserati, and Alfa Romeo that doesn't always make it here to the channel. Like when I visit Ferrari of Orlando and post a lot of cool cars on my Instagram and Snapchat stories. So make sure you check that out. But with that said, subscribe, click the notification bell so you can get these Ron's Rise videos straight to your inbox as soon as they come out. And we will see you guys in the next Ron's Rise video. Peace.